This is the end point. Ah. Oh. Okay, the true end point is that, where you're just going, oh. Like you, like you just had this most amazing thing. And the why? Because this is the most amazing thing. Look at that. I gotta just come up. Okay, but I was gonna back up. Before we get to this, we actually start with, and this is a major key important part of the Chocoveza. And this is cacao. Actually, this is chocolate. This is cacao that's been made into chocolate. So before this, we had this. And what is this? This is true, actual cacao. These are cacao beans sourced from Belize. Cacao and the process of making chocolate originated thousands of years ago with the ancient Maya living in what today is modern Belize. Stone Brewing co-founder Greg Cook met Belizean craft chocolatier Andre Shibkov in 2015 while sourcing chocolate for Stone Chocoveza. Impressed by the chocolate, Greg sought a supply of the raw cacao beans directly from Belizeum's certified organic plantation. Andre's involvement allowed Stone to source the right equipment and go through the correct process to produce amazing, organic, pure chocolate. Today, chocolate's cultivation remains largely the same as that practiced in antiquity. Belizeum's farmers tend to cacao trees and during harvest, seek out the ripe pods. Cracking open the fruit reveals white cacao seeds within. The seeds are separated from the pods and allowed to ferment in dark sheds. Once fermented, the cacao seeds are dried in the hot, tropical sun. After drying, cacao seeds are packed and prepped for shipment to Stone's chocolate processing kitchen. cacao bean. We actually brought them in unroasted and we roasted them ourselves. Um, we have some special ovens that do an amazing job of it. Now, Stone's team of chefs take over the chocolate production. Seeds are sorted onto sheets and slow roasted to bring out the flavors we know as chocolate. You're roasting them slowly so you don't burn them. If you burn them, you'll get an ashy or a bitter taste, a really bitter taste, more so than if you were to eat them raw. And then you get this, uh, the bean, the roasted bean. You crack it open, you winnow it, which is getting rid of the shell part, which is just very thin. You can just kind of crumble it in my fingers here, make some, some dust out of it. Right, that's just the shell. As you can see, it's very light, and you winnow it. It's a simple method by which you blow away the shell parts, and because the cacao parts on the interior are heavier, they kind of fall out. Once you grind it, it essentially liquefies or becomes something that can be liquefied. It's really delicious. And you take that, and what a typical chocolate maker will do is they'll combine it with sugar. Now, in our case, we don't. 
In our case, we simply bring, and then this is the, the ground chocolate, the ground cacao beans. Nothing else, 100% pure. To make the perfect chocolate for the brewing process, Stone avoids two steps crucial for making standard chocolate. We add no sugar, we add no butter, oil, or other emulsifiers. In the chocolate industry, this is known as chocolate liquor, or 100% pure chocolate. The resultant chocolate bar is perfect for imparting flavor to beer. One of the fun things with this beer is the first time somebody tries it. <laughs> I, I love that reaction. This chocolate, this won't rot your teeth out. This has no added sugar to it. This was made from whole beans. It is fairly coarsely ground, but it is all stuck together by that cocoa bar and bar form. So. It's intense. The thing I love about this beer, Chocovesa, is that there's lots of components here. There's, there's a lot of different spices. There's the lactose, there's the British dark malts, there's the English hops, so many different spices, pasilla peppers, cinnamon, the chocolate, of course, coffee. And they all marry together really seamlessly. It really has that same familiar sensation that you get when you have a chocolate drink that is not, not a beer. Now, why wouldn't we want to do this ourselves? Honestly, for the same reason that we like making beer, because we can control the exact character that we're looking for. We get to pick the exact roasting temperature and time, the way that we grind it, the volume certainly that we add into the beer. All of these steps we can carefully be the masters of, the stewards of, to get to this result. It is the Chocoveza. Mm. I have to set this over here. I'm just gonna keep sipping on it. So it's really cool. Very excited to uh, share with you the fact that we are making our very own in-house chocolate for the Chocoveza. We're chocolate makers, just as we are brewers. Focused on the finest quality, character, and bringing to you something that's completely honest. That's what we're all about. Now if I could just figure out how to take a big old bite of this. Can you bring me a knife? There we go. Oh, perfect. Actually knocked a piece right here. When you eat really amazing unsweetened chocolate, oh, it's so good. <laughs>